In this video, I'm just going to show you how you can implement filterable gallery in your WordPress website using Elementor. So in Figma, I was designing a landing page and the portfolio section was like this. And I was solving in WordPress, but it's a little bit complex. And you know, every single time go to every single post and put the link, so it's so complex. And now I just find out a solution for it. Let me show you. It's something like this, as you can see, when I just going to hover it, I get to see the preview image first, but when I hover it, I get to see the link with the different thing, right? And here is the filterable option that I can do filter. To do that, first of all, come your backend, I mean, your WordPress dashboard, and create a page, and also you need to install in the plugin, it's named Essential Add-on for Elementor. Just install this plugin and activate it, and come back to your page and click on Edit the Elementor button, then you will get to see like this type of blank page and search here filterable and drag and drop here this plugin with the name of EA okay just drag and drop so here is some of the setting basic setting uh, that you can see like how much post you want to show in here and also I'm showing you this widget because of its have you know, custom option, like we can upload our own SVG format, like the icon. So that's what I'm showing you. So when I will, when I'm just going to use this um, icon, so I can, I can use it easily. Now let me show you how we can add any kind of new portfolio in there. So it's simple. So if you go here, these uh, gallery items, then click on. Let me delete some of them for here. So now it's three. Let me put here the control name. Control name is for the filterable name. I mean for this name. So let me put here this name of one. And let me put different one as name two that you can understand very easily what I'm mainly saying. So here I'm just going to put it down two. And here's the one. And another is for the all. So let's update it. Just click on update button. And let's go back to the page and reload again. Now if I click on one, that I can see, I get to see only the one, and here's the two. I get to see only the two, and when I click on the all, I get to see all the, you know, images. It's also have a load more button, so if you wanna load more, then you can do. And it's have all that is necessary, I think. And if you want to customize the setting, I mean the style, then you can go the style and here is each have an individual style so you can customize it. If you really want to do then. And if you want to find out more solution, like if you don't like it, then I already uploaded a different video about portfolio filter. Just go to my channel and search portfolio, then watch this video. Thank you so much.